Hey everyone, Surreal K9 here. Welcome back for more Disgaea 3 Absence of Detention. I realize it's been a while since my last video went up. That is because. video games. <laughs> video games is why. I've just been doing kind of all the, all the different things, and I really don't have an excuse for just dropping my Let's Play out of the blue. But I am back. I have a very high quality microphone. It is a uh, Snowball by Blue Microphones. I have that plugged into my new desktop here, which I built myself. I know, amazing. And we are going to use this to play the game. I am here in uh, Chapter 8. I'm at the very end of Chapter 8, right before the final boss battle. Um, I can remember the controls. You can see my party here. Uh, pretty similar to what we had in uh, in the Rasbarrel episode, uh, minus a couple of DLC characters. Um, we have Beyond X and Chiron here in Pretty Mask, who uh, joined my team when I cleared the game above level 64. You have to have a higher level than the DS gentleman to get them to join your party on the New Game Plus. But once you have them, they are there forever. Whoops. They do not have any weapon fortes, so if you want to teach them things, you will have to... ...do so through the class world. It's kind of... or character fusion, I guess. It's kind of stupid, but, you know. They're kind of joke characters as it is. <laughs> I am not going to bother with them. We have Kyoko and Asuka here, Raspberry, Sapphire. All these guys who joined the party after the fact. Alma's, of course, left at the end of Chapter 7 and then rejoined. But in this particular episode, we are going to solo the final boss with a level 100 or higher Alma's. That is going to get us a hidden end. Uh, a hidden ending and launch us back into the new game plus with uh, with stuff and then my plan will be to re-record chapters six through eight proper uh, obviously with a much higher level party than normal but you know what can you really do about that I can't well I totally can blame twitch for deleting my streams because I thought I uploaded them to YouTube but there was an error at some point you know Anyway, enough complaining. Let's just play a video game. As for my recording setup, I am recording in OBS through my uh, through my usual, the Elgato uh, Game Capture HD, not the HD60, just the regular Game Capture HD. Gonna need that when I start recording PS3 games, probably. <laughs> Have you said your? We have... Well, we will already see this before. No, if you're watching in the playlist, you should have seen this already, because I recorded... Uh, I'll be recording this in the future and inserting it into my normal playthrough in the playlist. So we can just kind of skip this. Anyway, let us bring out Almaz. This guy shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> I'm just going to say that. And let you guys believe me. Oh yeah, he's immune to physical on eat odd turns. But I mean, still not a big deal. I mean, I'm not even taking that much damage from anything. I can just let my face get wrecked at pretty much it will. <laughs> Which, that sounds impressive until you realize what I just said. I'm like, take that arm. I'm reminded of, uh, of Hulk in the event, in the first Avengers movie when he just kind of smashed Loki and he was like, Phew, God. <laughs> I'm not even that, that big a fan of superhero stuff, really, but that was pretty silly. Anyway, yeah, not even a problem. I'm, uh, I think I'm gonna shut up here and let the ending play itself. I guess this is it. 
meet your killing blow, superhero. I hope you're prepared. Don't do it, Mao. It's all over. Move out of my way, Almaz. I won't let him live. Freaking system dialogue, man. It's... Calm down, Sir Mao. Have you been fighting only for revenge? It's a thing. You should have gained more than just that. Think carefully, Sir Mal. No, Sapphire. Mal learned nothing, because Almaz did all the work, as did Commander Video, but we're not paying attention to him right now. She's right, Mal. A really <laughs> cool main character lays it down awesomely at the end. Why? Why did you stop me? Weren't you the ones who told me the superhero was my true enemy? He's the root of all this evil! Why do you try and stop me now? You're right, he is the real enemy. But he already lost. It's over. I'm the one who gets to decide whether it's over or not. It's not your place to butt in and lecture me. Move, Almaz. If you're gonna stand in my way, I won't hold back for you. You can threaten me all you want. I'm not scared. I just don't want to see your heart in pain anymore. What the hell are you talking about now? Fine then. If you're going to stand in the way of my revenge, then I'll drop you all! Well, well then. You're going to point your weapon at us? Your friends? You prepared the meal perfectly, and you're going to ruin it at the end with the last dessert? How wasteful! Yep, this has officially gone off the rails. <laughs> well, if it comes to this, <coughs> then brute force it is. If he won't understand our words, he'll understand our fists. Please wait, Princess. I, I will stop him. Mal, let's duel. One on one. Me versus you. I was not prepared for this. What? Um, Why are you being so cocky? I kind of forgot about this. It's been ages since I got this. No matter what on the trouble PS3. awaits, a hero must stand, face forward against it. You have to wake up, Mal. I'm risking my life to stop you. Okay, let's see what we got here. Oh, he's only level 80. He, he doesn't even have all that powerful stuff. <laughs> it would have been more interesting if they took if they took the Mal out of the party and used that. I guess that wasn't really an option in 2008, though. Nah, I, I don't even know. One, two, three, four. Let's just finish him off. Here I go. Talk about an anti-climax. I was hoping for something a lot more engaging. <laughs> like with the, uh, like with the human world ending, which we will be covering at some point, but not now. I won? Are you awake now, Mel? <laughs> Damn you, Almas. Damn ex fake hero. You, my son. <laughs> That's Dad's voice. You could actually talk. What were you saying? You done it. Defeated my son. I, I, I'm so sorry. I took my liberties too far. I made a mistake. I'm glad you did it. For me. You disciplined my son. I thank you. Huh? What a dependable guy. With you, it just <laughs> might work out. Are you sure you know what you're doing, Overlord Man? It's kind of... Uh, uh... What about me? No way would I be considered fine. Hmm. I've decided. The next Overlord is you. <laughs> you're joking, right? No. Seriously, dude. Overlord for pretty confirmed! <laughs> <laughs> also, that's not how you spell dude! Overlord? Me? Ho, oh, oh, Almaz, the Overlord? How could that 
be? A human becoming the next overlord? It's happened before. Him? This weakling? The overlord? Don't be stupid! An overlord has to be great and strong! What could a coward like him do? And if you don't know what I'm referring to, I am referring to uh, Overlord Seedle from the, the Makai Kingdom. Who did beat you? <coughs> that was a coincidence! A fluke! My calculations were off a bit! Yes, you forgot to multiply your level by like six. Maybe then yeah, you could beat me back. Exactly what Mal says! <laughs> I can't be the Overlord! Don't worry, don't worry. You can do it. This seems really reckless of Mr. So the Overlord guy. Yeah, see, Almaz agrees with me. <laughs> I leave the Academy to you. This is just gonna turn out to be a disaster. Wait, are you serious, Mr. Overlord? Mm, the Overlord has happily passed on. From now on, Almaz, you are the head chef. Good luck, sir! Boom! That's impossible! Me? An overlord? I don't even want to be it! Give it up! You might as well take the pie that's been given to you. <laughs> you will rule the Netherworld and Evil Academy. Goodbye, boy! I leave everything in your hands. Go on with max firepower! <laughs> what the heck, Shamflu? You're just gonna leave him? No way! Hey, Mao, say something! I understand how you feel, Dad. Huh? Fine then. I will retreat to my room and begin researching and experimenting on how to defeat you, Overlord Almas! Prepare for my return! Oh jeez, Mao is out for revenge. What? I can't just sit here either. Miss Merrill, you believe me, right? Yeah, our badass role model becoming the super honor student overlord is something I've gotta stop. What? <laughs> Oh, amazing, my lady. You plan to stop a friend from falling to the evil path, even if it kills you both. Who says Almaz is going to be evil? What the heck, guys? Oh, what a tragedy. However, <coughs> that is what true friendship is all about. <laughs> Just you wait, Overlord Almaz. Wait, this is all a misunderstanding. Hmm, Almaz, you're now the Overlord, huh? Princess, you believe me, right? I don't want to be the Overlord. It can't be helped. Now that it's happened, I must defeat you before I'm kidnapped. You too, Sapphire. <gasps> Since ancient times, the Overlord always kidnaps the princess. This time, I'll make sure to kill you first. No! You're not supposed to kill him! You're supposed to kiss him! Almaz, next time we meet, your life is mine! And then get married! And have a million beautiful babies! Wait! Don't everyone go! Come back! <laughs> well, that happened. I don't even know what to say. Yeah, <laughs> poor Alma. Look at him, he's so sad. <laughs>
Yep, that happened. It's asking me to save, but it, whoops. Yeah, I'm not gonna save. The Nether World, a world spoil. Effort, Ninja Gorillion, join your party. Here he is. Man who performs miracles with effort. He insists it's a jutsu, but he's really just no abnormally patient. <laughs> the unlosing ranger has joined our party. Hundred forty percent speed, not bad. So do his damage. Not bad. Doesn't really have a place in the party, but you know. Alright. That being said, we have another ending under our belt. Um, at this point, I think what I'm going to do is if the. Uh, if the recording came out okay, I am going to end off here and I will meet you back at the start of chapter 6. How's that sound, everybody? I will see you all later.